Hello everyone, my name is Jules and welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong 64 in the last episode. We finished up our preparations for World 8, which is a name that I will not tell you even though I told you like five times before. And then we played that jetpack minigame that I claimed was easy and then it took me like 10 minutes. So in this episode we are going to be doing the entirety of the 8th world. And... Intruder alert! Intruder alert! It's the Kongs! Wake up! You fools, activate the machine! I didn't know that was K. Rool's voice. Um, okay. But, but, it's not fully tested! It might explode and destroy us all! Don't tell me what to do! Please, please, Master! Give us a few more hours! No! The... The time has come, and now we are seeing what the blueprints actually do! Other than give us, like, a lot of golden bananas. Here's the deal, Kongs! The blueprints you found have allowed me to block the Blastomatic's firing sequence for 50 minutes! You must locate and deactivate the machine in the main cavern. Hurry or you won't have an island to go back to. So this is timed and I think that we originally have 12 minutes. But if we get if we get a certain amount of blueprints, like it would correlate up. Uh, oh no. Um were we supposed to do this as Lanky Kong? Is there a okay the good there there is a tag barrel in here. Yeah, so for each blueprint we get, um, I don't know exactly how much it will raise the amount of time that we have by, but it will. And yeah, we just want to basically get through this as fast as possible. It's a pretty linear level. Um, there are no bananas to collect. You don't need like 450 or 500. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna run away from you. Um, okay, yeah, there is a thing there. Yeah, we need Chunky Column now. Because we need to blow, not blow up a pad, we need to shoot a pad. <laughs> okay. So, no. There, I got rid of you. Okay. Do we need another Column? Doesn't. Oh, I'll just move along, it's Chunky Kong. And we don't, it's just vines. Okay. Yeah, and the first part, the part we're in now is extremely easy. Yes, we need to be Tiny Kong now. Um, okay, Tiny Kong's over here. And... There is our tiny barrel. We can now go through that little pipe thing. Oh yeah, and we also have unlimited crystal coconuts. I think for the entire level, which is really nice, so... Yeah. Oh, and also, this level, I never actually saw as a kid, so... Like, I don't think that anyone from my family ever made it past um, what's it called? Creepy Castle? So, I didn't see this level until I was 14. And now we are at the Blastomatic! And there are numbered doors! And... We need to go here, and yeah, there is a battle pad there, but it is extremely hard, and we will be timed while we are doing it. We also only need four, so... There isn't really any reason to get it. Um, there's supposed to be like a ring that we can... A DK shaped star ring. Or did he? Um, I don't know, maybe it's here. Oh, I know what we're supposed to do. We need to be Donkey Kong because there's a really grab thing. Yeah, we still have a lot of time. Yeah, like when I first played this, I thought like, oh my god, 50 minutes, like... This is not going to be enough, but 50 minutes is a very, very generous time limit. Okay. And now the rains have appeared. 
You know, I just said that 50 minutes is gonna be a really generous time limit. We're probably we're probably gonna end this with like only a few minutes left. Oh no, okay, yeah. Yeah, we only have a minute to do that. And I hate how the timer like goes on when you're in the tag barrel. Oh yeah, this is probably gonna take forever with the Wii U. Not the N64. Okay. I'm just going to play very conservatively and go very slowly. It'll take a lot longer if we miss anything, so we are on a time limit for the entire level. You can tell that I'm like really focusing here. Uh, oh no. That's exactly what I did. Okay, and we did it! First try. And now we've unlocked all of those rooms. And I'm going to do them in order. And I think that the first one was for Donkey Kong. They are they're not in column order or the sort of almost column order like it was when we fought the bosses in. Okay. And we need to have Chunky Kong for every single Yeah, we we need to have Chunky Kong break open every single gate. Okay. They just need to have every... well, actually, we haven't had... Actually, we have used every column so far. <laughs> and we're gonna use every column again. Oh, and also, if you really... If you only have a few banana medals and, like, you really don't want to, uh, go back through the levels like I did, there are five banana medals just out in the open for this level. The thing is that... I really didn't want to have to exit it and then play the jetpack in the game. I kind of wanted to do this all in one episode, so... That is why I went back through the levels and got some bananas. Or by levels, I mean just Angry Aztec because we already had to get Chunky Kong's final blueprint. And... Yeah, and there's no way for Chunky Kong to get up to Diddy, so, like, there definitely won't be a gate there. Okay, we have all of them down! Um, their camera is working with me. Um, okay, I'm gonna go all the way around to Donkey Kong. And we are about to play our instrument! and enter the most time-consuming part of this level. So, there are many games that you have to play in order to sort of... Well, you'll see. Wow, it's Rambi! Go bash some Kremlins and... Oh, this one's really fun. Yes, yeah, so we have to destroy all of the Kremlins in 30 seconds. We cannot hit any of the power generators. Okay, so we don't have to get all of them, we just have to get a lot, but... Oh, we, we don't even need to do that. We just need to run in Yeah, this is gonna be really easy. Yeah, we're already almost done. And we did it! First one down. Nine more to go. Okay, and what is in this one? I remember some of these being really difficult. And... Okay. We got one. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, close. Close but no cigar. Okay. Yeah, we, we might be able to... Okay, um... Nope. Our first time failing. And we did it! Second try. Okay, and we are done with Donkey Kong. Yeah, I should probably get that banana metal thing. And we have destroyed the yellow barrier of the thing. Okay. And we now have gotten a banana metal that we don't actually need. But at least we're gonna have half of them, which feels a lot better than the bare minimum. 
Now, what will Chunky Kongs be? And play our triangle. I think it's like triangle tremor. Okay. <laughs> Had to give it like a little burp out there for a second. And you'll like this one, Chunky. Find the hidden Kremlins and oh. Oh wait, whoops. Ah. Okay. And that animation took like a quarter of our time. Yeah, uh, not, not in there. This one. Oh. And of course. Oh no, and we did it! Okay, for a moment I was like, we're gonna run out of time because I ran away because I didn't notice that a Kremlin had popped out, but we did it! And we have one more for Chunky Kong. And we are doing very well in time. And yeah, we have to shoot. Um, okay. Oh, and we have homing ammo, which is nice. Okay, one more. Like, the fact that they gave us homing ammo, that is very generous. Or, did we actually have that? I don't think we did. Well, we're done with Chunkies now, and... Now we have to do tiny. Even though Tiny's the fourth member. Like, they got the whole... <laughs> like, like, the order of, like, the DK members. Like, it's kind of strange how, like, if... Chunky... Not Chunky. Linky is, like, always fourth to do everything. Even though he's the third member, and then Tiny's the third, even though she's the fourth. It, it's weird. Well... Anyway, let's do Tiny Kongs. Although I guess that Chunky is a fifth and he got second for some reason, so... Probably because they wanted to do a fly-up to DK, not DK's, Diddy's. <coughs> now my throat got a little dry. And yeah, we don't need the oranges. So time to go into Tiny Kongs, and... Okay, we need to leap and do our ponytail twirl. Yeah, this one should not be too difficult. Um, and what is that thing? Like, why is there a question mark box? That's so strange Well, there's a question mark box there. It's like, there's no point for that. Um, ow. Yeah, that, that will hurt us. And, oh, this one! This one is hard, but it's really fun. So, we have to not fall onto the floor. <laughs> I undershot it a little bit. <laughs> I'm probably going to try and overcompensate, and so I overshoot it. Because that is just how I roll. Or how I twirl. Okay. Well, I'll meet you when I'm done. <laughs> That was the, like the last, not the last one, the second to last one. And we did it! So we are done with Tiny Kong, and now to move on to, I think, Lanky Kong. And the purple light is going out. We have 35 minutes left. We are doing wonderfully. Yep, Lanky Kong is next. Even though we could do Diddy. Diddy, you can do this in any order. There's a bunch of you probably all assumed. Okay, time to switch over. And on the other side of the Blastomatic, we have Lakey Kong's things. But we don't know what they are yet because I haven't played this game in a long time. In like a year and a half. 
And I also haven't played this part in like two or three years, so... And, okay, we have to finish the maze. Um, okay, jump in! Um, I'm gonna restart that. <laughs> Okay, uh, we might do it. Um, yeah, it doesn't seem like we need to actually do that. Um, okay, it seems like we did need to go there. Oh no, Akasha. Wait, what? Wait, uh... Okay, maybe, maybe there's like some sort of rule that I didn't see. I I'll actually read that. Hit the switch in the hidden in the maze, then reach the finish line. Um, okay, well we know where the switch is. We just don't know exactly where the. Okay. Um, seems like the finish line is on the other side, and I just didn't see that this was a three-way intersection and not a two-way intersection. And we got hit by Akasha, but it didn't matter because we did it on our, I believe, like, third try. Maybe fourth, because I restarted, because we kept on missing the barrel. But we now have it, and we are doing wonderfully on time. We have a full half hour left. And... Okay, good, we have... Um, blasting you. Yeah, the Mecha Zeners. Um, I looked at what these guys are called, and they're called Mecha Zeners, which makes sense. And it seems like we did just luck out and start with... ...on the Homing Ammo, because we only started with 11 and not like 20 that time, but... Like, having the Homing Ammo, that has just... That has done wonders for us. Like, most of the minigames that I have trouble on, the N64 one, are the shooting mini games, and like with the super sensitive control stick on the Wii U, like those were the ones that I was worried about. And unless there's one with Diddy, then we are home free. And now we are in our jetpack, and Diddy Kong's is right in here, and then they're gonna. I was about to make a joke about how they were going to troll us by putting a chunky gate there that only he can press, but... One, that was a terrible joke, and two... I kinda didn't get to finish it before we saw that. And please don't be a... Oh good, it's not a shooting one. Never mind. well, I mean, like, it switches, not enemies, so... Yeah. Okay, we shot one switch. Two switches. We should be able to do this in one try. I'm so glad that they gave us unlimited crystal coconuts. Three. And you can't see me, Kasha. Well, you can see me, but you can't get to me, and I'm going to be too fast. Oh no. There, we did our super duper scion slam, even though we didn't. Nah, I'm rambling here. Okay, and now we are in the second one as Diddy Kong. And yes, we just need to beat all of the Kremlings. And then that switch will turn into a real switch. Okay. That thing sounded like it dropped something. Did it drop? Okay, no, we're, we're just wasting time. Okay. And... We did it! With just over, not just over, just under 30 minutes left on the timer. We destroyed the Blastomatic. That went so much better than I thought. And yeah, 50 minutes is a very, very generous time limit. And now our island won't get destroyed and we need to destroy King K. Rool and 
I actually think that this is the last game in the series to have King K. Rule, because I think that the... Actually, no. That's right, yeah, there was, like... Um... What? <laughs> that was kind of weird. That was a bit of a glitch. <laughs> yeah, it's like fell through the barrel, but we still had our gun out. It's a little funny. Okay, and now I believe that King K. Rule is... At least his room! It's over here. Unless... Yes! And there is one solitary Kremlin! And we now can come here anytime we want because we unlocked the pad. And we have enough of those and seems like a cutscene. And King K. Rule is fleeing because we're gonna fight him somewhere else. And then computer stuff. And he has a reptile plane. Yeah, this episode is running a little long. Like, I'm 24 minutes into this recording, probably like 20 minutes into the episode. But we are almost done here with Hideout Helm. And it's now the room where he was creepily spying on us with this thing for some reason. And, oh, it looks like there is a fairy. And there is where all of the stuff is. And this is why we needed the banana medals and to get the Nintendo coin. Oh, and there are two fairies. Uh, okay, we have 18. Even though we definitely didn't get any of them. We get these fairies. Um, we might have gotten that. Nope. Okay, that one had to counted. Okay, that one. Uh, I'll just meet you once I have the fairies. Okay, that one definitely should have counted. Maybe I like have to be fully inside the room. Get that key once I have the fairies. Okay, we have one of them. Wait, did we get both? I've never gotten two fairies in one shot before. Oh, okay. And we have the final key! And I guess we just use the exit level function. So I will meet you back at K Lumsey's. Because he can finally be free! After four months of me playing this game. And now... The final lock is unlocked. And Kalumzi's cage is lifting.
And Kalumsi's prison is now empty. And the plane that K. Rule used to escape has crashed. I'm gonna switch over to Donkey Kong for no reason. And if we warp to the number three pad, we go in here. It's the final boss. It is King K. Rule. And something that I should probably mention. I have never actually beaten King K. Rool. Next episode, we are going to be finishing the game. It will be the finale of my first Let's Play, and what a journey this has been. Like, when I first started, like, I, I was so nervous getting in front of the mic. And, like, after I think this is episode 34. Like, after 34 episodes, like, it's, it's just you kind of feel so natural and so fun. Like, I started out with literally no audience, and it took me, like, over a month to actually get one. And so I just want to say thank you to everyone who joined in once the Let's Play was, like, halfway through and just continued to watch. And it just makes me so happy that I'm actually able to be a Let's Play. Like, it doesn't matter that. Like... For those of you in the future, at this point, I have 11 subscribers. <laughs> and I'm just happy that 11 people are watching. So, thank you. And this has been Truly Outrageous Jewels in the next episode. We are going to be finishing the game. I will see you all then. Goodbye.